Five Nights at Freddy's Security Breach is back. Last week, we got the true ending. Today, we're getting some secret endings. Okay, so this is where we left off last week. Like I said, we just killed William Afton. We got the true ending. So the first thing you guys told me to do is play all of the Princess Quest games, and that will unlock another ending. So I haven't played any of them. I think the first one's in Roxy Raceway. So let's go there and try to beat Princess Quest number one. If you guys want to see more Five Nights at Freddy's on the channel, don't forget to hit that like button and make sure you subscribe right now. Okay, so I think Princess Quest number one is right there in Glamrock. There are so many security guards. Oh my gosh, what if I get this guy in the face? Ah, Warning. Got him. With okay. Sorry about that, buddy. So, oh my gosh, there are so many. I don't know if, uh, Roxy's down here or Chica. I don't know if... Uh, Warning. Uh, tampering with Fazbear thank, automated... Sorry. Result in suspension sorry. Of okay, I don't know where it is, but it's definitely... At least I think it's some... Yeah. Yeah. Oh, there it is. Princess Quest number one. Okay, so I'm pretty sure there's three Princess Quest games, and if I beat all three of them... I don't know what the secret ending is, but you guys told me it's awesome. Princess Quest. Working title. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna love this already, I can tell. Oh. Okay, hello. Hello, beautiful princess. Can I... Oh, how nice. I got an extra heart. Oh, no. The fact that I have four hearts makes me think this game is gonna get really, really difficult. Okay, can I go through this door? I guess I can. There are holes in the ground. That seems great. Uh... The door is shut. Well, I could have figured that one out. What if I turn these on? Aha! I'm a what are those? Are th is that Bonnie? Wait, I assume I have to light all of these things. Maybe if I turn the lights on, the animatronics will stay away from me? Well, I don't know. I call this thing an animatronic. I, I don't really know what these things are. I'm cornered. Okay, this is, this is not going to go well. You guys know I am way too bad at video games to be able to do this. Okay. Oh, wait. Wait, there was a door over there. Oh, there's like a chest. How do I get to it? How do I Excuse me, princess. D do you mind jumping over the wall? It doesn't look very tall. Oh, I could probably enter over here. Okay. Uh, if I enter here, there's the key. Okay, so now I could go back to that last room and open the key. Why did it get so dark? Dark! Why is it so dark? And what are those? What are these things? Oh my gosh, this is bad. I'm gonna have to... Uh, okay, I lost one of my hearts, but you know what? That's fine. That is fine. Okay. I made it. I made it here. Let's turn. Oh, I do not like those things. I really do not like those things. Okay. What's the name of this princess? What are we going to name her? Let me know in the comments. What is her name? I'm going to name her Marianne. Yep. It's Marianne the princess. Okay. She is pretty quick. I'll hand it to her. She's pretty quick. How many lights are there? Is there one back here? Got it. Got it. I, I heard the door open. Okay. Let's try not to lose any more hearts because I have a feeling this game is going to keep getting harder. Okay. So I need a purple key. This door appears to be locked. Well, thank you. Once again, I could have figured that one out on my own. This door... Wait, there's the... Oh, there's the purple chest. How do I get across this giant void? Excuse me, Marianne. You mind jumping? Nope. Nope, she's too much of a princess to jump. Okay, let's go over to this side, maybe. Yeah, this looks good. Anytime, anytime I'm being chased by something, I can pretty much know that I'm going the right way. Are there any lanterns to light up? I don't... What am I doing? I don't even know what I'm doing. I'm just going random directions, hoping that I'm going the right way, and somehow I was. Wow, that was a miracle. Okay. I assume I want to turn all of these on. Why are they going out? Why are they all going out? Oh, there's numbers on them. So maybe I go in order? Maybe zero, one, two, three. What? This one's also three. <laughs> what? Four. Seven, eighty-five. What? What am I? So oh, all right. I gotta figure this out. What if I go one, and then two, and then we're gonna go three, and then this one looks like it would have had four dots, but something kind of smudged one of them, and then this one might have two dots above the three. We actually got it. Okay, that took me a very long time. I'm actually embarrassed at how long that took me. All right, I guess we're gonna go down these stairs. And here's the purple key. Here's the purple key. Please tell me I can just go back in peace now. What if, oh, they're going to give me a gate. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Please be the end. Please tell me this is the end. It's not the end. It's definitely not the end. I do have five hearts now. So even if I get hit four times, I will still survive. Hello? I, are, the, are those supposed to be subtitles? I don't know what that says. 
I don't speak whatever language that is. Is that a uh, body language? I don't- Oh, I did it! Okay, so now we got one out of the three Princess Quest games. I really have to save before I die and have to do that all over again. Now, you guys told me I wrote it on this post-it note. Princess Quest number two is actually in the Fazcade, which was upstairs. I do not miss this place. This is when the giant spider was coming after me. Monty and Chica killed me a bunch of times. Yep, there's Chica. So Chica's definitely here, and I'm pretty sure Monty is too. So I'm pretty sure Princess Quest 2 is all the way in that back room where, like, all the broken arcades were. I think that's where it is. Ooh, this looks like Princess Quest 2. This looks like Princess Quest 2. All right, it's still a working title. You think if they made Princess Quest 2, they would have been confident by the title by then, but I guess not. Here we go. You are alive. That is good. Oh, I didn't read. I didn't read what the rest of the guy said. Can I talk to him again? Oh, I have a sword now? Oh, no. Oh, that's bad. You guys might be like, Brandon, why would you not be happy that you have a sword? And I'm not happy because I know that means I'm going to get attacked by something. I'm going to go through the left door for now. I have a feeling I'm going to start. Oh, okay. Here's these guys. Can I attack them? Ha! Oh, ha! Okay, so they take two hits to die. Do I have to kill all of them or can I just kind of go around them? I'm just going to go around them for now. These guys aren't too hard to avoid. Uh, oh, whoa. What is that thing? That thing walks. That thing walks and talks. Well, actually, I don't know if it talks, but it definitely walks. Okay, I assume this is probably why I have the sword and also why I got the fourth heart, okay? So let me know in the comments, what is the lore behind Princess Quest? Because I don't know what this is all about. Is this supposed to be like Bonnie or, or any other animatronic? Or is it just a random video game? Uh, are those? I, what are those? What? Okay, now they're throwing snowballs at me? D does that seem like a reasonable thing to do? Oh my gosh, that guy hit me right when I killed him. But that's okay, I got a heart back. All right, let's kill these guys before they throw more snowballs at my head. Okay, uh, get him, Brandon. Get him. Marianne! I called her Brandon, but her name is Marianne. Okay. Uh, my storyline is crumbling up uh, right beneath my feet. Okay, uh, got him. Am I going the right way? I don't know if I'm going the right way. Oh my gosh, I'm losing so much heart. So many hearts. I don't think that was English that I was speaking before. Okay, somehow I'm back to full health. I have no idea how, but I will not complain. Will not complain at all more of these stupid snowball dudes. Snowball dudes. Okay, I actually don't mind the walking, talking zombies. Again, I don't know why I say that they're talking because they're definitely not talking. It's the snowball throwing dudes that bother me. Okay, I turned on all the lanterns. Oh, maybe I didn't. Wait, I probably didn't turn on all the, all the lanterns because that thing's still closed. Now I think it opened. There we go. Please be a key. I got a key. I got a key. Now I think I probably have to come back the way that I came. Because in the in the uh the, the first room, there was a door that was locked. Am I supposed to go this way? Oh, here we go. Here we go. So now I assume this door will unlock. Beautiful. Wait, do I want to light up the red one? Do I Oh, hello? What? Uh, are you are you my enemy or my friend? What- what is going on? Wait. Did I- Okay, I think that was supposed to be some sort of a puzzle, and I think I accidentally solved it. I have no idea what I did. Oh, there's more monsters. More monsters, and also more snowballs being thrown at me. I don't think those are supposed to be snowballs, but I'm just gonna call them snowballs anyway. Ah, die, you stupid snowball-throwing bunnies. Ugh. What? Why is that thing sucking my brain? Another lantern over here. Oh, I heard something open. I don't even know what I was trying to open. It was probably this door. Probably this door. Man, these games are big. I thought Princess Quest was going to take like, you know, like a minute, may maybe 45 seconds each. These are like full-fledged games. This is fun. Here we go again with these darn puzzles. Last time I got lucky, so I didn't even figure out what I'm supposed to do. There's no way this is just going to work. Okay. Wait. What am I? How do I? Oh, maybe I, I, I have to get her to light them. So if I like stand here... But then I turn it off. Oh, wait, maybe not. Maybe not. Here we go. Beautiful. And then... Oh! Oh, okay. I figured it out. So I just need to get the ghost girl to light it. Wait, why is she... Why did she unlight that one? Okay, I thought I figured it out, and I absolutely did not figure it out. 20 minutes later. Oh! I... I don't know what I did. <laughs> I keep figuring out these puzzles and having no idea what I did. So now there's a door down there, but I feel like maybe I should go through this door considering it just opened. Congratulations, your quest is done. Time to sleep. I'm not tired. I don't want to go to sleep. Should I go this way? 
Oh, now we're in like the security office. Oh, I did it. I did it. Okay, so now the final Princess Quest game is in Vanny's room, which now I don't remember where that was. I'm pretty sure Vanny's room is somewhere in Phaser Blast, and Phaser Blast is right back here, so I think I'm going the right way. I remember this place was also riddled with guards. Well, now that I have Monty's claws, can I hit the guards? Oh, ah, get back here. Ah, get back here. No, apparently not. I guess I can't hit them with, with Monty's claws. That would have been way too easy. Okay, so if I come back here, now I have to hop outside of Freddy. Oh, I also just saw a prize. It's nice having Roxy's eyes too, because this thing kind of stuck out. What's going to be in here? I don't think it's going to be anything important, because I probably would have needed it. It was a Freddy balloon. Okay, you know what? That's fine. Hopefully this door is just open. Oh, wait. No, darn it. This is the door that I need to be open. I, I just closed the game and reopened it, and now it worked. Okay, so if I cr- Why can't I- Why can't I get in the office? Why can I not crawl in the office? Uh, it, the door is clearly open, but it won't let me in? I wonder if I can just do the full ending, pick Vanny, and then when I'm in the office, then play Princess Quest 3. Can I just do that? Okay, so I made it to the front door. The problem is, because I did, like, that cheat where I can save after 6 a.m., the doors aren't open. Is it gonna let me... Oh my god. Oh, it did! Okay, so we have to pick the Vanny ending. Okay, so this is the cutscene where Freddy fights Vanny, and then he gets decommissioned. We already saw this in a previous episode. If you missed it, go back and check it out. But then we need to get up to Vanny's office right there and play the final Princess Quest 3 game. So Roxy is going to barge through one of these doors. I think it's this one. I can outrun you, and I will outrun you! My goodness gracious. Okay, then we have to go back this way, but then Chica starts coming after us. See, this is what happened to me Wait, why is Monty on the ground there? Whoa, that is different. Maybe because I killed Monty already, this is different now? Oh, this might just jump scare me if I try to get past them. I'm gonna try. Oh my gosh. Thank you. Yes, I can hear you loud and clear. Now Vanny's office is open and we can see Princess Quest 3. Still a working title. You think by number three, they would have gotten a solid name. Oh, we're picking up right where we left off. So here's the question. If I die, do I start over with Princess Quest? I see one of these guys down here. Let me kill him before he comes after me. There we go. Do I just come back to the beginning of Princess Quest if I die? Or do I actually die in the game and have to start over? Because that would be a little bit more difficult, and I don't want to deal with difficult. I also assume each one of these games is going to get harder and harder. What are we- Oh, we're in the pizzeria. How do I- The door appears to be locked. Okay, this is fun, man. Oh, I like this conveyor belt. Oh, 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 I don't like the conveyor belt. Now I realize the conveyor belt kills me, and I don't want to be killed. Okay, okay, let's be careful here. I'm back to full hearts, which is kind of a miracle. I don't know how I got back to full hearts already. There's the stupid snowball throwing dudes. Oh my gosh, these stupid snowball... Uh, there we go. I'm gonna kill everybody. Hey, there's Chica's face. Oh, I do not like the conveyor belts anymore. I changed my mind. I don't like them anymore. Can I walk? Oh, I can. Okay, I could walk the opposite way. I just walk a little bit slower. Okay, so far all of this seems relatively good. Wait, how do I... Come, come on. Come on, princess. Walk faster. Use those tiny legs of yours. Okay. And let's go up. That that actually wasn't that bad. Did I... Oh, no. This is going to get harder, isn't it? Oh, there's the ghost girl. So I bet I need her to light the purple one. Let's do that. And then we should be able to light the one up here. Like that. Beautiful. And now the conveyor belt is taking me right there. Let's try not to die, Brandon. Let's open up the chest. And I got... Well, what did... What? I thought that was going to be a key. Oh. Wait a second. Oh, that's hurting me. That's hurting me, so I can't go in there. I think I just- Okay, so I found one out of the two plushies. I need to find one more plushie, and then I should be able to open up the flaming chest. Dang it, I can't believe I- Oh, I shouldn't have tried to open that. Oh, there's Foxy. I don't know if I want to go that way. Oh, I gotta be real careful. I have a feeling Foxy's gonna start coming after us. This is kind of cool. This is the first time in the game we've actually seen Foxy. And he's like, flaming Foxy. Can I- Oh my gosh, I can't get through there. Uh, there's definitely more of these. Beautiful. 
Flaming Foxy, stay away from me. I'm a nice guy. Oh, I promise I'm a nice guy. I promise. Why is that still closed? I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die to Flaming Fo- Oh. Wait. Oh, maybe I was supposed to- No, never mind. I thought maybe I was supposed to lure him that way and he was gonna, like, set the bushes on fire? No, nope, that's definitely not what I had to do, Brandon. Definitely not what I had to do. Come on, there's gotta be one up here. There's gotta be one up here. Yes. Beautiful. And now the torches are gone. Or, I mean, the, the bushes are gone, but Foxy is not. Foxy's definitely not gone. How am I supposed to get around him? Hey, buddy. Okay, chase me. And then I'll do a little loop-de-loop -loop and pull. And my shoes are looking cool. That was a SpongeBob quote, if you guys didn't know. And now, okay. And now I got the Vanny plushie. No, oh, oh, oh. Don't hurt me, Foxy. I'm down to one heart. Don't hurt me, Foxy. I'm down to one heart. Oh, this is bad if this is how I die. And now if I come down here, the chest is open, but it's still flaming. I really wish I didn't have one heart. Okay. Please don't kill me. Yes. Oh, purple key. Purple key. Maybe I need the purple key to get into Foxy's Cove area. Yes. Please tell me this is it. Oh, it's not it. It's definitely not it. It's definitely not it. Brandon, I only have one heart. Oh, thank God. Now I have two. Now I have two. And that means even if I get hit once, at least I'm not dead. Now I have three. Oh, thank goodness. Oh, I've never been so happy to get attacked by these creepy black and white animatronics that throw snowballs at me. Something I never thought I'd say in real life. I said it again, and I will say it again. Oh, what's this? Can I open this giant door? Oh. Did I die? Oh, this is the secret ending. This is the secret ending. Okay. Uh, error. So Gregory's playing Princess Quest 3. Now he's stuck? I don't... I don't know. All the security guards have been decommissioned. Uh-oh. I think that's good. I don't know if this is a good ending or a bad ending. Well, Vanny looks like she's dead. That's good, right? You gotta get out of there, Gregory. You gotta get out of there. I have Freddy's head? Go on, superstar. I guess Freddy was just decommissioned. Wait, is that Vanessa? Oh, I think this is gonna be a good ending. What is this final scene gonna be? Oh! We officially turned Vanny good! It's Gregory, Freddy's head, and Vanny sitting on a hill eating ice cream. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and check out my other YouTube channel. It's called TFG Vlogs, and I will see all of you in the next video.